Welcome to Accordance Basics. This tutorial will introduce you to your Accordance library. You can open your library by clicking the Library icon on the toolbar, or by choosing Library from the Window menu drop-down. Your Accordance library is divided into different types of resources, such as texts and tools. Next to the search bar in your library, you'll find the Filter button. You can select a type of resource from the filter menu to only display resources of that type. So for example, I'm going to select texts. In accordance, texts are primary sources, such as Bible translations, Greek and Hebrew Bibles, and other ancient writings. Now, let's select tools from our filter menu. Tools, on the other hand, are secondary sources, such as commentaries, dictionaries, journals, theological works, and more. By default, tools you own are categorized by literary genres and fields of study. You can click on any of the category drop-down menus to see resources of that type that you own in accordance. If you hover your cursor over any of the resources in your library, you'll see two buttons appear. You can click the Info button for more information about the resource, including its full title, copyright, publisher information, and more. The second button will amplify the resource. This involves searching that resource for any content related to a highlighted selection. So, for example, if I amplify all the people of the Bible while having the name John selected, the work will open showing me entries for all the biblical characters named John covered in that resource. We'll cover amplifying and its uses in a future video. For now, it's enough for you to simply know that this option is available to you. Notice that the filter button is highlighted. This indicates that you are currently showing only a portion of your Accordance library. You can click on the Filter button and choose Show All to return to your full library list. At the bottom of your library, you'll see two other major categories. Background includes the Accordance Atlas and Timeline, while My Stuff includes your custom resources, such as any user tools you create, papers, and stacks. We'll cover these sorts of resources in a future video. You can also search your library for specific resources via the search bar. So, for example, if I type Bible into the search bar, every resource which has the word Bible in its title, or which has been tagged by Accordance as a Bible, is now shown in the library panel. And that's it. You're now familiar with the basic features and navigation of your Accordance library. If you want to go further and learn how to customize and organize your library, check out the video from our Quick Tips series linked in the description below.